at Doha International Airport. So anyway, we are staying here in Doha for two hours. So join us again as I share with you our next flight from our next flight from Doha to Barcelona with a different aircraft naman. Papunta na kami sa gate. We are at gate C55 which is on the other end of the airport. At least we have nice business class seats in this flight. I am in seat 1E and this is how the seat looks like. First order of business for George, kailangang ipaba ang divider. Both passengers on each side has to press the button at the same time para bumaba yung divider sa gitna. Ang swerte talaga namin kay Qatar ha? I'm so being sarcastic. So ngayon, naka dreamliner kami with this kind of business class with the door. But unfortunately, they don't close in this aircraft because may problema. But as a compensation, they're giving us a free Wi-Fi voucher for the entire flight. Qatar Airways offers Wi-Fi on board for $8 if pre-purchased before the flight or $10 when bought during the flight while Avios members get one hour free Wi-Fi. So again, this is the Qatar Dreamliner Business Class in the aisle seat and this one in the window seat. There's a big screen. Tray table is here below it. There's a nice mood lamp on the side. A small compartment for the bottled water and headset where you can also place your small stuff. Remote for the TV and chargers here as well. There's a wireless charger for the phones. Unfortunately, it did not work for my phone. Probably because of my phone case. By the way, this time, they have Type-C charging port. These are the buttons for the seats. We have two pillows. And also, a thick blanket. This is the amenity kit the protective kit, and the hand towel also from Dipti. The protective kit has mask, gloves, and sanitizer. So again, the amenity kit is from Dipti, and it's in a nice bag now. It still has face cream, lotion, lip balm, perfume, socks, and earplugs. This is the bag naman for men. The in-flight entertainment also has a good selection of movies. The remote is also responsive. This is an extra compartment that is also an armrest. Here's the leg room with an extra storage space again and the seat pocket. Let's check out their menu. You can also pre-select your meals from 15 days before your flight. They also have a good selection of wines. Unfortunately, I don't drink, so hanggang so Jenny lang ako. And now, it's time to depart. There's also an aisle at the back where you can stretch out and get some snacks anytime during the flight. I checked out the lavatory and this is how it looks like. Soap and lotion are also from the peak. This is my favorite part because I don't need to push the trash bin. The lavatory has been kept clean the whole time actually. 
Again, as I was in the lavatory, they already made my seat into a bed. They also gave us pajamas too, but I did not change anymore in this flight because it's just a 6-hour flight anyway and I am so, so sleepy already. We're already about to land, so they woke me up for my food. I got the soup of the day and our pre-ordered lobster thermidor. I was supposed to eat this after takeoff, but I was so sleepy, so I told them I'll just have it for breakfast. Qatar Airways serves food on demand in business class, so you can just tell them when you want to eat at any time during the flight. This lobster is really good. I really enjoyed it. And then I just had some fruits for dessert. Since we're already landing, they started fixing my seat. I was also amazed by this camera view because we can see how we are landing on the runway. This is the first time I slept through the entire flight. The first time. Kahit dati nung nag-SG kami, uh, hindi rin ako business class. Then A380, hindi ako nakatulog masyado. But this one, uh, slept the whole, the whole time. And good morning. We just arrived here in Barcelona. This is our first time actually to travel to Europe. So, we're all excited and also scared at the same time. Kasi alam nating, you know, ang balibalita dito ay medyo uh, hindi siya ganun ka-safe. So, we're all hoping that we won't experience anything na ganun during our trip. So, we're staying here in Barcelona muna for the first three days of our trip here. And then we are joining the Royal Caribbean Cruise uh, eh, on June 30. So, and dito na yung sundo namin. We availed of the airport transfer kasi nga hindi kami familiar. Hi! Good morning! So, nagpasundo kami dito sa airport. By the way, before we left Manila, nagkaroon pa kami ng konting problema. Upon waking up, biglang nakakuha ng notice si Daddy na cancelled yung hotel booking namin. So, we were initially booked at H10 Casa Mimosa. So, buti na lang nakahanap pa kami ng may available. So now we are booked at uh, Hotel Catalonia. Okay, so now we are booked at Hotel Catalonia. Pasig de Grash. So sa elevator na kami. We'll see you later. transfer from our first hotel pa cool. age 10 Casa Mimosa so si George contacted them na lang directly and told them that we already have a different hotel booking kasi nga na-cancel yung first hotel namin nandito na kami sa airport transfer namin finally napagbigyan na ko sa request ko <laughs> naka-few suite na kami <laughs> may few suite sa bus nga lang hindi sa Qatar Airways for reference again the same hindi pa nakakapanood ng first vlog nakailang palit kasi ng aircraft si Qatar Airways na the reason why we took Qatar is because of the Q-suite primarily because of the Q-suite but unfortunately two days prior uh, nagpalit na naman ng aircraft and we ended up getting the non-Q-suite flight so ayan, pinagpigyan Q-suite <laughs> So just a quick update on our uh, Qatar Airways flight from Doha naman to Barcelona. Our aircraft is the Dreamliner 787. Well, I'm sorry, I won't be 
actually enjoyed Qatar Airways. Agree? Yes. Good service. Yeah. Good. Very good service kahit yung ngayon sa Doha to Barcelona. That's true. Yeah, so masarap. Fun. And the lobster, by the way, the lobster that we had today was actually better than the lobster that we had with Singapore Air last time. Mas lasa siyang lobster ngayon. Ang sarap. So, it was a good choice. Yung Katari nyo, kamusta yung Katari ko? Hindi ko nakita. Sa kanila. Ha? Oh, sa kanila, okay lang. Sabi nyo, sarap. <laughs> oh, by the way, nabigyan din kami ng voucher for uh, unlimited wifi kasi yung door nung suite namin, hindi ko magana. Tapos, unfortunately, yung saming takda ni Matea, yung hindi ko magana. Pero yung kay Daddy and kay Vito are working. Pero at least we got a free Wi-Fi voucher for the entire flight. Na hindi namin nagamit kasi nga lahat kami tulog. Tapos yung experience namin sa immigration sa, sa Barcelona, so, ang bilis. It was the fastest also immigration experience and an international arrival that we've had so far. As in, walang tanong-tanong, walang pila, manual stamp. Tapos uh, walang security check going out also. Dinadiretso ka lang. So it was also pretty fast. So we had a good flight experience so far despite all the hassles of aircraft change. But still, uh, okay na yun. So hopefully our stay here in 